Hi guys, in this tutorial I want to show you how to bypass the Google account on your Samsung Galaxy S7 and the method is the same for Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge and uh, also should work on Samsung Galaxy S6, S6 Edge and S6 Plus. So let's do it. So first thing that you must do is to select your home language and hit start. And now you must connect to a Wi-Fi hotspot. I will connect to mine and I will enter my password and hit connect. And now hit next, hit again next, hit agree. And now you must verify your account because this device was reset. Okay, to reset this device, just hit back. And here at terms and conditions, hit learn more. And now hit enhance features. And hit award push long. And now hit share. And push long on Android logo. And now hit force stop okay and again and now hit the battery and here we have change to a power saving locating method now if you don't have the option change to a power saving locating method in your menu don't panic just disconnect from your wi-fi network put an active sim in your phone Pass the language select screen and then let your phone on sleep mode for a few hours. I don't know, five, six hours. Okay. And after a few hours, just remove the SIM, connect to Wi-Fi network again and try and you'll see that will option will appear in your menu and it will work. Okay. And hit this. Now hit Google location history and hit yes again and now hit here the three points and hit help and now you can have access to Google Chrome so hit open with Chrome hit accept and continue and hit no thanks now on the search bar, just uh, type this link. Okay, I hope you see the link. You will find the uh, link. Uh, you will find the link in the video description, and hit go. And now you will be redirected to an application. Okay, this is the application. This is the quick shortcut maker. And hit here, hello. And now you must download this application and hit OK. And now it's downloading. And uh, now just hit back. Again, hit back. And go to the search bar and here type Google okay and hit Google okay and uh, in Google on uh, the page just uh, type here Samsung Galaxy apps okay and hit Galaxy apps okay and now this is the link you must push on this link and here scroll down and hit this icon Samsung Galaxy apps hit agree and hit the search bar and type here file explorer and search and now download this maxi explorer file 
Explorer. Okay. And uh, now you must enter your password and uh, user and password for the Samsung account. If you don't have an account, just click, click on create account and it is very easy. I, I already have an account and I will enter my email and my password. And now I sign in. in. Hit accept and download and wait a few seconds. Now hit the play button to open this application and here just go to download and here is my application that I downloaded before. Click on the application, hit view and open with package installer and now hit settings and enable unknown sources hit OK and hit install and now just click on open and here in the search bar type Google account manager hit on this here hit down and now you must select Google Account Manager, type email and password. I hope you see it. Okay, type email and password. And now here hit try. And here hit the three points and browser sign in. Hit OK. And now enter your own Google account, your email and your password. I will enter mine. And now I'm signing in. And now I'm back in the Google account manager. You must power off your phone and hit restart. Again, restart and wait until your phone will be restarted. And now Hit start. You are connected to Wi-Fi hotspot. Hit next. Again next. Agree. And wait. And now your account has been added. And hit next. And wait a few seconds. And now hit not now and hit next. Hit no thanks and hit skip. Skip anyway. Okay. Hit here set up as a new device and hit done and hit next. Hit later again later, next and finish. And now you can access your menu in your Samsung Galaxy S7 and now let's go to settings and scroll down and hit backup and reset and go to factory data reset and uh, here hit reset device and hit delete all and now you must enter again your Samsung account password. I will enter mine and hit confirm and wait until your phone will be restarted. And now Select your home language and hit start and you must do the initial setup. No need to connect to Wi-Fi hotspot. Just hit next and next. Agree. And now 
the setup is over and let's go to settings and go to about device and here is my device device name Samsung Galaxy S7 model number G930F and let's go to software info and the Android version is 6.0.1 and the Android security patch level is from March 1, 2016 but this method also worked for Android security patch level April and May. So this was, was my tutorial for today. I hope you enjoy it and if you want you can subscribe to our channel. Have a nice day.